Hello everyone. So today what I'm going to do is <laughs> so it is morning and I am going to finally take these guys out after a few weeks. They're definitely overdue. Very bad lighting guys. I'm kind of like walking around trying to film. It's super early in the morning. So let's see if I can get some better lights for you guys. Yeah. So we're going to do a few things today. Take out these braids, they're old enough. They need to come out for a good wash day, not half one. And I'm also going to do my hands, manicure, pedicure. You guys can see my face. I am going to probably do a cleanup of that. I need to like shave the fuzz off. You guys see I have a couple of breakouts. And my eyebrows aren't done, so. So guys, this is completely not where I usually would film. But... This is just super short vlog. I told you guys it's time to take these out. I'm going to pretty much be doing a cleanup day today. <laughs> and pretty much just take these guys out. It's so easy. One of the things I want to show you guys is hairstyle. It's not only easy to take put in, but also super easy to take out. Because first, of course, I need to take out my jewelries. And I'm trying to vlog a lot more for you guys. I'm not good at all at doing that. You can see my fun mannequin behind me. This is my little cosplay area. So all this you see behind me, all the carnage, it never gets fixed. I try to organize it. I don't know if anybody else does art, but every time I try to clean it up, it kind of ends up like this. <laughs> I see my pal. That's pretty much how it ends up. So, yeah, that's what you get. It's not really much I can do, really. I just kind of give up at the end of the day because when I'm doing something like painting or anything like that, oh, look, this is how I take these out because I already braid my hair. They're super easy to come out. And I love how it's not like extra dry. Make sure guys you hold the root when you do this. Gently pull it out. And if you feel like it feels like it's stuck, stop and actually unbraid it.
you can see my face has been ignored for a little bit. Make sure you guys the cleanup process. I do a few days before I do glycolic pill to get rid of all of this. Had some quite a bit of pimples on my face for the past couple of weeks. I even have one here. I haven't had these in so many months. So yeah, we're gonna basically get this taken care of this morning and then in a few days we're gonna go ahead and actually i'm gonna go ahead actually and use the glycolic pill on my face so guys very easy not easy this is like a long morning routine that i do so guys let's get to actually doing my face first thing i'm gonna do is clean my face now because i'm gonna go ahead and use a glycolic pill I usually use like a super gentle cleanser, which is going to be this guy. So I'm going to be using the CeraVe. This is the hydrating facial cleanser for no one to dry skin. So definitely want to wet your face. And this is what this cleanser looks like. It's like really, I don't know if you guys can see this, but this is what it looks like. I go ahead and actually wash our face. It doesn't foam or anything. That's why I like to use this cleanser. So because I'm doing this while I have some inflammation acne is going on, remember guys, try to avoid anything you have that's happening going on. These are the only active acnes I have. very careful when you guys do like your around your eye area i do it but it's really thin so be very careful and kind of like try to come just about here It's almost the only area that I will shave down on because this is the best way to actually clean this area and I don't get cuts like that. Now for forehead, I do it weird. I do it going like gliding on the side because this is the best way to shave it. Right. 
doesn't take too long. <clears throat> In real time for me, this takes about like 10 minutes, something like that. Now one other thing I do is, you get out like my skin is kind of dry and I'm done shaving guys. The other thing I do is I will go back just a little bit of oil, not as much as before. Because what I'm gonna do is do like a really light shade like another just now oh, come on. I'm gonna go ahead and just So guys, what we're gonna do is we're gonna move on to our eyebrows. So I got this guy the other day at Burlington. It was $6.99. I always wanted one of these, but every time I went to Walmart, they were like $20. So no, was not getting bought. So <laughs> when I saw this was $7 at Burlington, I decided I can try it now. That's cheap enough, $7. So we're gonna be using that for our eyebrows today. So I normally would be using this tweezer guy. I have it, it might still be needed, but I'm gonna try this guy first. First, first time, first impression, let's see. Here we go. fix our eyebrows so we can do this let's clean up the part I can see that sounds scary <laughs> let's see how it works this is actually pretty cool actually chopping off the excess hair. I may actually go get a mirror guys because this is not working out. Okay, this is officially how I'm doing my eyebrows now. Not the tweezer. You don't feel anything like this doesn't hurt at all. You just feel it. You just hear it pulling the hairs. And look at how nice it cleaned it up. I am so excited about this. Now I'm happy I bought this. It just takes a little bit of time. Let it get all the hair it needs to and then you're good. Now let me do the other one. <laughs> So guys, I don't know why I spent so long and but didn't buy this, 
But if you do your eyebrows at home, go get this. It makes your life so easy and pain free. I usually would have to steam my face to pluck out my eyebrows because they would hurt so much. But using this, I don't have to do any of that. Just clean my face and use this little tool to take them out. And it's so easy, like it's like a little fancy pen. It's it's nothing. And you just clean it afterwards. I'm gonna go ahead and clean this later, but eyebrows done. How about that? Super finished. I don't do any fancy thing to my eyebrows. I just kind of shape them. And as you guys can see, it cleaned up so well. Like, I'm excitedly amazed by how nice this turned out to be, actually. I thought I was going to have to do a bunch of stuff, plug this, do that. No. All done. I absolutely love it. How amazing is that? Boom. That's pretty much my morning, what I was doing with that. And I'm going to go and eat breakfast get something to eat and actually figure out other things i'm about to do i think i'm gonna make some oatmeal